The James Webb Space Telescope will perform its science mission while orbiting a location in space one million miles away from Earth, called the Second Lagrange Point, or L2 for short. L2 is a point where the gravitational influences of the Earth and Sun and motion of the orbit combine to create an equilibrium. As Webb orbits L2, the telescope stays in line with Earth as it travels around the Sun. The telescope's optics and instruments need to be kept very cold to be able to clearly observe the very faint signals of very distant objects. This location is perfect for Webb's sunshield to block out light and heat from the Sun, Earth, and Moon. Unlike the Hubble Space Telescope, Webb's orbit keeps the spacecraft out of the Earth's shadow, making L2 a thermally stable location for the observatory to operate. Well, JWST has the ability to look at objects from Mars on out. So it can't, of course, again, it's orbiting uh, just outside the orbit of the of the, the moon. About It's about four times further away than the moon. Um, so it always has to be pointed out towards deep space. It can't ever look back towards the Earth. So for example, it could never observe Mercury and Venus, um, but it can observe Mars and everything on out. And in fact, during that first year of observations, we have detailed plans to look at lots of objects in our solar system, from Mars, some of the, um, the moons of the outer planets. Um, so there's a whole list uh, that you can find online of, of objects within our solar system that JWST is planning to study during that first year.